Do I consider an OOT an old game played by old men? No, OOT is still a brand new game played by young hip people. Yeah, still relatively new relative to the age of the universe. That That is true. Making your dog look. Wait, is your dog actually reacting to this? To the sound? Am I scaring any dogs right now? I'm sorry. Okay, I won't scare. I won't scare any more dogs. I'll. I'll leave it here. That's the last one. Dog's head just turned. <laughs> All right. Cack. Oh, twenty is hover boots. All right. So only only twenty is good. But it's very good. I know, talking to them for the hint is relatively new. It used to be that uh, you could only get them from Gossip Stones, but they added an option for getting it directly from them. Bottle. Pretty nice. You guys ready for Mario Kart in a week? Look shot in Zora's Domain. Oh yeah, if it's the Sculptula by the Frozen Waterfall in Zora's Domain, I can get that, but it's a bit awkward. With, is that? That's magic. You see his shadow MQ. Ice cavern. Come on, Tunic. That's nice. Good tunic color. Okay, forest is at Ganon's castle. Logging off adult. Followed by 175, skirt key 85, 15, I should probably get that. Need to buy sticks. 175, this is Spirit Key 85. Lens is cool. On the wall in Jabu, okay, that's definitely worth going to. Nice music transition. I think the the great C music I think was supposed to be Malin singing, and then this is the actual overworld music. Not a single shop has sold a Deku or Hylian shield yet. Never buy a shield. Not not in no logic. In no logic, always buy a shield. Uh, hopefully this works. What? And now I don't have six. Uh, surely this should work. How do I get this to work? Dude? Hylian, shield bombs, choose. <laughs> Fantastic. Dude, I would like a weapon. You know what, I'm gonna go in Deku first to see if I can get a weapon or a stick or something and then check outside. Okay, it is Deku, uh, but I can't kill them. So Deku's Deku. I can't even check the slingshot room because I can't reflect the nut. Also, I won't be able to leave this room because I don't have a stick. Please give me some weapon here. I can't even check the skull to blood, dude. Oh my god. I have to just save warp out. I need my sticks back. Dude, I hate them having to skip all the soil patches. 
when I have bugs. Thank you, that's super good. I can go get bombs now. Alright, now I can finally farm sticks. And Decker Shield, thank you. Purplo Rookie. Alright, there's Hookshot. Okay, so, um... I know Jabu's Bomb of the Well, and I want to go there soon, but I don't want to go there immediately, because... With bombs, it'll be much better. Uh, so I'm gonna go get bombs, and then I guess I'll check out Goron City. Goron City, finish up Kukiri, and then go to Bomb of the Well. And then... Also finish up Deku. I forgot that I need to actually farm rupees. Uh... Oh god, where am I farming rupees? Do I just do this? This is so bad. Network error? Okay, this time it wasn't me. This time it's not my internet going down. I didn't disconnect. Thank you. I can't fix Twitch. No one can fix Twitch. Okay, hello again. That time it was me and not Twitch. So we can share the blame. Uh, if this doesn't get better soon, I... I don't want to say I would just stop because I don't want to like stop in the middle of a rando, but this is getting annoying. And I don't really know what's going on. Bongo. Maybe reset. Okay, well, so the thing is, I had a power outage earlier today before the stream, which, in theory, that should essentially be a free modem reset, right? So, like, my stuff should be essentially freshly reset. Yeah, the power hedge time save. Go on sword. Burrow's Wind. That's especially good considering I know where magic is. Bomb little key ring, exactly what I was looking for. The neighbor's Wi-Fi ain't what it used to be. I swear it's my own Wi-Fi, it's just my ISP is not the greatest. I don't know, they're like fine 90% of the time and then 10% of the time they're terrible. Warren City moderately loaded. Did you guys get to hear what I said about my ISP? Probably not, I assume. Did it cut out like right before I was talking about my ISP? Alright, that's funny. Yeah, maybe I should just go to Starbucks and use the Wi-Fi there to stream. It's probably better at this point. Okay. Ocarina, nice. Oh, and I should be able to buy Lullaby before uh, I go child, or go back adult. So having both Ocarina and Lullaby is really nice. Uh, I was gonna death warp, cause I, oh wait, okay, I'm just, well, I'm gonna die now. That was a mix of wanting to death warp slash wall master warp out, but then it combined both of them and now it wasn't that fast. No, I was specifically trying to avoid save warping because save warping is slower than either a death warp or a wall master warp. But it is not slower than if you do both at the same time. That just uh, isn't, it wasn't quite my intention to have both activate, but sometimes it works out like that. Hyrule Field Foolish, thank you for the good hint. I was about to waste my time on that. Yeah, Hyrule Field Foolish is a pretty big hint. That probably saves like two or three minutes. 
Yeah, that includes all the grottos. Fire is... Morpha. I am not doing Morpha right now. I have Hookshot. There is no reason to do Morpha without Hookshot. Yeah, that means the Hyrule Field being foolish means that every check in Hyrule Field is bad. There's not a single good check in Hyrule Field. Skull on the Roof is only there as an uh, adult. Lighter. Didn't I get lighter in that same spot recently? Or was it another Nightcack Skull spot? The other ocarina? There's magic. And Goron Bracelet. <laughs> After an extremely slow start, the seed is picking up pretty fast. Nice. I don't have 20 skulls yet, do I? I think I have like 18. Yeah. So my only way to kill the skull on the wall up there is with 000. zero, zero. Sun Sun. Okay, that makes things easier. In fact... No, not yet. After the grotto, I'll play Sun Sun. Oh wait, this isn't gonna work out the way I- Er... Uh... Okay, this... This is not gonna work out the way- Okay. So, here's my plan. My- Er... Okay, what was my plan for this was that I was gonna meet Malin and then play Sun Song there. And then from there, I can do 0, zero, zero to kill both skulls. But... Um... Malin's not there, and I can't get there, and... The thing with 0, zero, zero on to kill the skulls... Is that if the skulls load in, then you can't hit them on zero zero zero. And I think the only way the skull on the house doesn't load in is if you load in in the center of the map. I'm actually pretty sure I can't kill it this way. I guess I could try. I just have to hope that it was never close enough to load in. Alright, it was. Cool. It's a key. Can't get it right now. Oh, I never marked Sun Song. Uh, by bombs. I might have been able to scam that if I did it faster. Dins. Very nice. Chess game actually worth. Storms. Nineteen. Twenty, nice. So I can get hover boots first thing as a doll. Uh, this one. Er, wait. No. This one. Yeah. All right, I think the only real significant item I don't have right now is bow. M minus uh, boomerang, mirror shield, and hammer. Like, m minus the significant one-of-a-kind items. Uh, all I really need is bow, but uh, I'm doing pretty well. After a very bad start, this turned out pretty decent. Fire Temple, Vanilla, uh, yeah, I can do this. Yes, I do have Cox. Are you surprised? My ISP, chat. Just save warp out. Okay, so Shadow is fire.
so I actually was thinking about um, having the shops enable uh, or require Tycoon Wallet. There's a problem though. The way that the wallet increases are implemented is that um, they can be any price from zero to the wallet you select. So zero to adult's wallet, giant's wallet, tycoon wallet in uh, five rupee increments. The problem is from zero to 999 or zero to 995 really, uh, all five rupee increments, uh, almost half of all possible uh, price values are over 500, which means that if you set the possibility for requiring tycoon wallet, what it ends up being is a 50% chance for any item to be to require Tycoon Wallet, which is a little bit too insane. Okay, so those two those two grottos gave me bow and shoes. That's really good. I uh, know the Storm's Grotto is adult too. I just forgot it. I'll go back for it soon. That's not Sunsong. Forest is Jabu Vanilla. Gold scale. Fires. Oh my god, can I actually... <laughs> That's not actually good because I need Rudo, but it's amazing that I actually can make that cycle one time if I didn't need Rudo. I can probably only do that with Bunny Hood and Hover Boots. Mudango. Bolero. That's actually extremely good. That's literally where I want to go next. I really need to stop getting skulls. I don't need them anymore. More medallion. Scam. Colossus foolish. Half the desert is foolish. Dunno. Those are pretty much the three things stopping go mode right now because no matter what I'll always need at least two of hammer boomerang mirror shields. So those are pretty much I need two of those away from go mode and then I guess boss keys potentially also but those since those are specifically in their own dungeon I should be able to find them without too much trouble especially since I have lullaby. Wallet. I swear that particular skull has been wallet several times. Okay, I can now buy Song of Time, Bomb Chews, which don't really matter now. Uh, I guess the only thing it really buys me is Song of Time. Uh, no, Kikuri and Bigoron definitely don't count as junk. Or Kikuri at least definitely doesn't. Long shot. Huh. So, my hinted. <laughs> My hinted hookshot was in Zora's Domain, and they were both in Zora's Domain. I guess I'll never know which one which one was the actual- well, actually, I can check the spoiler log and it'll tell me which one was hinted at, but that's interesting. I wonder which one was hinted at. Yeah, they were both like almost, almost near the exact same place, both above the waterfall. One was the diving game, one was the Skulltola. Baronade. Cool. Okay, go to f water next. Yeah, water, then GTG, then spirit. You know what? I have long shot. 
I'm gonna do the the glitchless method. Since I have long shot and gold scale, it's very rare to have both. Might as well make use of it. Ganon's castle. Did anyone just get that that message in chat about N A N ways so far, or is that just me? All right, we raised N A N dollars, guys. N A N more days to raise money for mysterious charity. Playing Wester go karts are faster. Definitely Wes. I would totally win a Mario Kart if I could pass around the track. Uh, does this make it? This doesn't make it, does it? Oh my god, that was a bad idea. Uh, how do I die? Please, void here. Oh my god, I actually got the clip. Alright, actually, you know what? That actually saved a lot of time. So actually, that was intentional. I was trying to do the safe strat, but I actually just ended up doing the risky strat, but was still faster. Okay, so I know Thieves Hideout, Wasteland, and Colossus are all junk, but not Gruta Fortress. But Gruta Fortress, the only checks are the two Skulltulas and the chest. There should be a very quick check through here. Oh yeah, and the Storm's Grotto. Oh yeah, I guess Archery. I guess I do have, uh, I do have Gerudo card, but I don't have a Pona. I don't have a Pona song, but I could go get a Pona, but I'm not gonna steal a Pona just for that. I don't have any hints on Archery being good, so I'm not gonna get Archery right now. Very cool. Let me guess, Spirit is gonna have Twinrova. Phantom Gain, okay, not Twinrova. Don't need to get that either. Vanilla. Okay, so... This most likely means that I should Spirit Hover, because I, I don't have access to Spirit Temple. So I know that uh, I essentially get like a free skip in the dungeon chain, whatever dungeon chain leads to Spirit, by doing Spirit Hover. I think three sub is this neat. Come on. Fine. Oh my god, leave me alone. Okay, that was junk. Uh, I should just. Reset now? Yeah. Because I saved with... I saved after I set for Rosewind, right? Yeah, I did. Okay. Okay, so this should let me... find out what leads to spirit. Water. Okay. And what leads to water? Because I haven't found water either. So I can go backwards in this chain. Shadow. Okay. Uh... I can at least check bottom of shadow. So shadow, water, spirit. So if nothing's here, uh, I'm just gonna reset. Save scum. I got good information. Shadow entrance is DC entrance. Or sh DC entrance leads to shadow, yeah. Oh, there's a water entrance fix? Oh, I have not, yeah. I guess I haven't updated in like a month or so. I probably should. Man, what sucks is, um, because I don't know where Twinrova is, there's a good chance that Twinrova could be the end of, uh, Spirit Temple. And if it is, then this sucks because this entire chain is not useless, but, I mean, kind of useless. So I kind of hope I don't find Twinrova at the end of this chain. Actually, what's really weird is how few fire keys I have, considering fire is vanilla. So there should be eight fire keys, and I've only found, like, two? Yeah.
Bosky, uh, good timing. Fire key, okay. I'd probably want to keep that fire key. Two fire keys, okay. Definitely want to keep those. Partially explains the lack of fire keys. DC. So this is a long chain. So far this is shadow to water to spirit to DC. I think it has to end here. I think I found every dungeon now. I found no, I haven't found GTG. So I could still find GTG, I think. If this ends at GTG, I'm actually gonna be kinda mad though, because if I don't get a boss out of this, that'd be kind of annoying. Okay, so forest and fire are the only other dungeons I have access to that aren't part of the chain. So between DC, Forest, and Jabu, I must find GTG, Twinrova, and one other boss I haven't found. Goma? I think Goma, yeah. It'd be great if Goma was at the end of this chain. All these dungeons lead to Goma. Wallet. I'm rich. But um, the main one is uh, Indigo. Indigo is looking really good right now, and there's gonna be a demo coming out in April for Indigo. So that should be good. I did notice the strength, it's just I was talking in the middle of it, and Silver Gauntlets isn't that important right now. But don't worry, I know I got it. No, not Go Mode. I need, for Go Mode, I need at least two of Boomerang Hammer Mirror Shields. And right now I have zero of them. Trinrova all the way back here. Man, that is kind of annoying. That's fairly bad because I don't have Mirror Shield, and so if I get Mirror Shield, I then have to go down my that whole dungeon chain, which is very long. Please don't. Are you serious, dude? <laughs> I hate this room. Uh, the small ones just take one bomb, the big ones take two bombs. Yeah, it's easy to not notice they have different sizes if you don't see multiple in the same room, but if you saw there, one of them was clearly smaller than the others. Say an aim. Who wants to say an aim? Actually, I might want to go to Child and finish up Child. I think I should actually do that. I'm about to get Mirror Shield. Uh, are you sure about that? Oh, well, there's Mirror Shield. There's one. I didn't reset Furrow's Wind in Spirit Temple, did I? I dispelled it and didn't reset it, didn't I? Oh boy. Eh, it shouldn't be that bad, actually. I just have to do Spirit Hover a second time. Which means I have to go all the way there a second time. Okay, so... I have to go all the way back to... I have to go all the way back to Colossus. Okay, never mind. Seriously. To avoid any potential dumb stuff happening. Oh yeah, now I can long shot across. <laughs> yeah. You normally can't long shot across because the chest isn't there until you get over there, but yeah, I forgot that. I already spawned the chest. That was a bit awkward. Light medallion. So with no keys, I can't do too much, but I can do a little bit. Especially since I have lullaby. Actually, I think I pretty much 
only have to skip like Dark Link's area and the boss key area. Yeah, you guys are trying to trying to get all the information out of me. I mean, I kind of want. Okay, Iron Boots, nice. One of them must have Goma, and I don't know which one. Actually, wait, do I know which one? Let me double check. Forest Temple. Okay, Forest Temple is Goma. So that means Fire has GTG, but I know GTG has a uh, Forest Key Ring. So I may want the Forest Key Ring before I go to Forest, but I could potentially skip needing the keyring altogether. Do I usually boast to people about how well I can execute Zelda's lullaby? Yeah, the first thing I tell people when I meet them is, hey, did you know I can I can play Zelda's lullaby super fast? And they're always so impressed. I was like, oh my god, how can someone play Zelda's lullaby so fast? Also, I don't even play lullaby that fast. People can do it faster. I'm actually pretty slow at most songs. There's the boss key. Wait, I don't even need that boss key. That's a useless boss key. Alright, I'm out of here. Water was junk. I got nothing good here. Okay, I'm gonna go to Forest Temple. I'm gonna see... I'm gonna hope that I can get by without uh, any keys. Uh, I should be able to check... If I remember correctly, I think I can actually check all but one check with zero keys. If I do hookshot jump to bow, hopefully I remember how to do that. I haven't done it in a while, but I should remember. Um, but there is one check I think I need a key no matter what for. Wait a second, this is going to be pointless. Or no, it's not going to be pointless actually. Okay, this is fine. It's not going to be pointless, but it's not going to be as useful as I want because the elevator is going to go back down uh, if I reload the area. And I have to reload the area for the hookshot jump, which I have to do because I don't have any keys. So, the, this elevator trick is pretty much only to get these, and I won't be able to- well, okay. I guess if I get the boss key down here, then I guess it's fine. Guess it doesn't matter then. In that case, it was not pointless, it was extremely fast. And then I know this must be Goma. Sapphire. All right, so I just need just need boomerang or hammer. Now that I already got the forest boss key, I'm not sure if I should really bother doing hookshot jump. Actually, you know what? I really shouldn't. I can only do a few checks in shadow, but I might as well just stop in here and just do like my three checks. Oh, well, there's the boss key. Not that I need it. Cool. Oh, cool. We raised NAN dollars again. Good job, everyone. Oh, is that like a glitched raid message? Thanks to the raid, Bloodshot. Alright, that's an interesting glitched raid message. There's the boss key. That's good. That gets me to GTG. Shadow key ring. Nice. Okay, so I can do shadow after this if I have to. Cool. Nothing here. Alright, time to go to shadow now. Er, wait. No, GTG. Save warp and check the boss room. Okay, so this... Yeah, GTG. Please boomerang your hammer here. Fury sword. Not that it matters now. Requiem. Cool. There's Hammer. Volvagia is GTG Requiem. So Hammer was behind Fire Temple. Dude. I almost died on that. I'm pretty sure if Volvagia hit me there, I would have died. 
but I somehow dodged it. Spirit medallion. And then this will be Ganon boss key. About to mark my Ganon keys, but whatever, it doesn't matter. And then Water Temple is uh, Ganon's castle. So just head down to water. It's just me of these randos getting shorter and shorter. If anything, I think they're getting long. Well, I mean, they're getting shorter as in I'm getting better at playing them and routing them and stuff. I mean, I should they should be getting shorter in general. Although I'm also trying to balance it with harder and harder settings. So it's a little bit of both. They get shorter and then they get longer. Do I intend to become the rando god? Uh, I mean, I would like to be good at uh, these high glitch requirement settings, but there's also not many people that do them, so there's not much to compare to. When am I joining the next community race? Well, actually, there actually have been more no logic community races lately, but they're always at like not very good times for me. Um, but I kind of do want to try entering some more. Uh, but they also use not quite the settings I use. They're like a little bit lighter. But I do still want to. I want to try entering some more of those. So maybe. All right, that was a neat seed. Had a cool dungeon chain going on. Okay, let's check the spoiler log. I guess the only thing really to check is where uh, Boomerang was. Boomerang was Shadow MQ after Wind Enemy Chest. Okay, so it required a Shadow Key, but uh, so I, I would have been able to get it, but I would have always had Hammer first. So if I didn't find Hammer in GTG, I would have gone to Shadow next and then found Boomerang. So that actually means both Hammer and Boomerang were behind GTG. Hammer being in GTG and then Shadow Key Ring being in... Or wait, was Shadow Key Ring in GTG or was it in Fire? No, it was in Fire. But still. So Shadow Key Ring in Fire, Hammer, past Fire. Spirit MQ Child Hammer switches a Pona song. Okay, so a Pona song was behind Hammer. Uh, what else was like? Oh, I also want to check that hint about a uh, hookshot. Does it say where my hookshot hint is? Wait, is there? Is the hookshot hint in the spoiler log? I thought it should be. Uh, I guess not. I guess it only has the gossip stone hints. Okay, yeah, so I guess I guess I don't get... I guess there's nothing about the hookshot hint. That sucks. I, I want to know which hookshot was actually hinted at, since they were both in Zora's domain. Oh well. <laughs> 